Everybody that's a real nigga I will go broke just to stack for you Anything you go through, I'm here with you I will go through hell and back for you What's the goal? What's the purpose? Tell me now so I can get through my love for you Flowing to the surface, remember when you told me Yeah, this angle isn't the best Like the lighting, I don't I'm not liking the glare right here My fire alarm goes off every week It was on it went off yesterday for five hours. Okay. So the fire alarm finally stopped. And so, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and try to do this again. Okay. Hey everybody. Yeah, I forgot to ask y'all what y'all think about my intro. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and play that back for y'all one more time. Thought it is a real nigga. I will go broke just to stack for you. Anything you go through, I'm here with you. I will go through hell and back for you. What's the goal? What's the purpose? Tell me now so I can get through my love for you. Flowing to the surface. Remember when you told me. So I'm about to take y'all on a little tour. Um, just to tell y'all beforehand, I'm not really gonna include my room because. I honestly need to perfect my room. Like, that's just the most important area where I'm gonna be because it's gonna be like my little sanctuary, basically. Like, it's gonna, like, it's just where I'm gonna be all the time. And I just really need to make it the, the best area of where I live. So, I'm gonna show my living room, my kitchen, my bathroom. I'm still putting it together. But I'm like, I can just update y'all throughout my channel as I like add stuff, change stuff. So, like, at first I was like, I'm gonna just wait till I get this, um, at first I was like, I'm gonna wait till the whole video, I mean, at first I was like, I'm gonna wait till the whole apartment comes together, but I'm like, I can just update y'all, like, it's not that big of a deal, like, <laughs> and so, yeah, I'm gonna still, like, get, like, a few things, like, I think I'm gonna get, like, two shelves for the living room, I'm gonna get one of those cushion things that you put in front of the couches that, like, my mama has one, I'm about to show y'all. And I know I'm getting more more kitchen decorations, more, I need to get more wall art. I know I'm mounting my TV. I know that, I know I'm mounting my TV. I know I wanna get more patio decorations. I mean, furniture. And um, it's just a few things I know I wanna get. And so I'm gonna just update you. And so, bye -bye. and so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just get it started. And so, Oh, and let me close my pantry because <laughs> I don't have anything in here. <laughs> and so um, this is like, you know, the little, I have love you most, of course. I want to hang. This is just so heavy and I don't want to mess up these walls. I'm going to figure it out, though. I might just put it on my shelf. And I have that on top of it. Have a great day. Stay sassy. Oh, have a grateful day. My mom. Okay. And then I have my sisters. And then... Ex of course my little sign except what it is let go of what was have faith and what will be so and so pantry little door my little hallway closet um my little washer dryer i need to hang up these pictures and these are the legs that actually go on my couch i have to get them put them on my couch my mama has really been bugging me about it and so i just took them out but um, this is my like a uh, little shower, and then I have two shower curtains. I'm gonna get a new one. I like this one. I don't really like this one, but it was a gift. And my old but shower decorations, like this and this, and it's my little cabinet. Not too much stuff. Like, razor, splat iron, soap, wash towels, alcohol, um, more soap, lotion. Lash cleanser, hair stuff, oil. Some hair stuff's over here though on the actual shelf. Oh, I have my bathroom rules, um, brush and floss and wash and flush. Simple. And now that's the bathroom. And then, yeah, like, a lot of lights, huh? Like, which y'all, there's so many lights in this apartment, but I like it. I hold three pounds and so these have been staying all day i mean for two days and so i think that these are good they're white it's the only thing but it's cool like so i have collect moment not collect moments not things y'all know 
inhale exhale staying like little puffs i'm gonna get some more though because just to make the apartment and so my vanity finally i'm gonna go ahead and just and i'm still kind of these are the light bulbs that came with i need to put out the boxes because i literally well, my stepdad just helped me put it together literally like yesterday and so i have to throw out the boxes and stuff like bow and i think i'm gonna put some like well i got this little um chair for it but it really came with that chair but um i'm gonna get since i got this one since it's cuter i'm gonna get some fur to like some white fur to go on top of it to make it like a little cuter and then um i'm gonna get another rug because i thought that this one was gonna be a little bit um longer than it was so i'm gonna just like put them together and make two and y'all probably like great but i don't want a white rug why would i i mean i have one i need to mount my tv i think that's where you mount it i think that's why that's up there and I was going to get a projector for this wall, but my best friend was telling me she thinks that I should have put it on this wall if I was going to do a projector. But my couch is over here, and it just would be weird because the balcony door is right here. I'll show you out the balcony. I might um, redo this again in the morning because right now is my time. Got my little bench out here. Look how big this balcony is. Like, I love it. It is a little curve. It's cool. Little wonder. Isn't this is so freaking cute? Like, I love it. And so, so yeah, now I'm going to go ahead and just show y'all what it looked like without furniture before I moved in, what I was shown. So yeah, um, okay. Yeah, so my stepdad was just over here. I forgot to ask him to help me put my pole up. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna put it up. And so, I'm gonna just update y'all, like I said, throughout my channel. Like, it's no big deal. Like, I didn't have to have it for this video. Like, <laughs> okay, so yeah, it's the next day. But yeah, even though this is a, it's a random day and my curls kind of look cute, I feel really confident today. Like today, I'm going to make a bold move. I feel out of my comfort zone. Still not drinking this week. Let's see how long this is going to last. And yeah, like I'm going to just start making bolder moves. I feel like I, I be in my head too much. I be trying to think about stuff. I'll talk myself out of doing stuff, but just do. Like I'm going to just do and then think later. As long as it's like I'm talking about... Y'all know within time, though, I'm going to ease y'all to it. I can't give away too much too soon, like, but yeah, like, um, I feel it. Today's going to be a great day. I got a good night of sleep. I put a protein mask in my hair today. Hopefully it comes out cute. I can't wait to see how it's going to look when it dries. I'm glad I said that. I forgot to put one more product in my hair, but um, yeah, like. I'm about to head out, and it's going to be this. Okay. Okay, let me stop. I hate, I smell so huge. I just smell too huge, but um, I think my hair came out pretty good. A part of my hair, a part of my edges up here is kind of coming up. I can kind of see it, but it is what it is. It's going to look cute still. And so, yeah, I feel like I already know how my hair is gonna do. It's not gonna dry cute. My hair is not gonna dry cute, I already know. We're gonna see. I'll update y'all my dress. But, um. Uh, very interesting. 
Good morning. Rise and shine. Grand rising. All that good stuff. Like. <laughs> but I'm about to get up, get in the shower, start my day. And you know, get it going for the day. So let's get it. But yeah, um, I just got my stuff together for the day. And so, I'm just waiting. So I'm trying to wait, I'm trying to wait for it to lighten up to go inside. Hopefully that's within the next 10 minutes. So I just got home. Um, I left work early so I could take a nap because I'm gonna do a turnaround today um, to go to Austin. And um, my sleep schedule is so crazy. Cool. <gasps> so that was cool. I'm about to clock out, and that's gonna be that. <laughs> But yeah, y'all, I just feel really bad because my friend, I was working with her tonight and right now it's almost five o'clock, but it's probably five o'clock, but last time I was working with her, she stole my customer. Like I was speaking with a Hispanic customer that I've gotten money from before. And she come over there and start speaking Spanish and take him on, like, that was annoying. Hold on. Yeah, I saw her back again today and he came. So I'm guessing he's one of her regulars now. But like, let me know what's oh, going on. I'm thinking he just went my customer, like. But long story yeah. short, I just feel bad because I blocked her off everything immediately. And I was talking like, hella shit about her because I was mad at it. She just came up to me and she was like, because I'm interested in her, like, months ago, I was starting my YouTube channel. I'm like, but yeah, I'm into her months ago, I'm starting my YouTube channel. I'm like, do you want to be in it? And she's like, no, because nobody knows that she's a dancer. So she just comes up to me and she's like, so how's the YouTube channel going? The YouTube channel going? And so I posted my my new intro today. So that was weird because I blocked her off everything. So I started laughing. She's like, why are you laughing? I'm like, because that's a random question. She's like, why? And I was like, because I mentioned that to you like one time. And she was like, you thought I forgot? Like I had you on all sorts of Girl, you know, I blocked you off everything. So I don't know if that was her way of mentioning it, but either way, I just feel bad because she made me feel like a, a bitch for blocking her off everything. Cause like, <laughs> she's just so nice. Like it's hard for me to be, it's really hard for me to be mean to somebody that's nice to me. And that's why we always end up getting on, but on the terms because she's nice. But she just be thinking I'm gonna forget about it. Like, no, like, yeah, let me get in my car. But yeah, that was that. I just wanted to finish telling my little story. Let me see if I can pop my phone. Let's see how much that got me. Okay, I think I should make it to Houston. No problem. weird that it didn't do more than that but whatever so I'm currently at Whataburger in line but yeah I'm currently at Whataburger right now y'all so yeah I just feel bad like it's so annoying because I actually really like her y'all and it was really annoying to have to block her but like um I felt like she crossed me, but like now I'm feeling like she didn't cross me. And she was still being nice. It would have been one thing if I would have just blocked her, 
we would have went out like we never spoke again but she's still like nice and like i just feel bad so i guess i'm gonna apologize when i see her it'll make me feel better and if she wants to still be friends we can still be friends that's on her but yeah i guess i'll apologize when i see her because it'll make me feel better and if she still wants to be friends we can still be friends but like if she feels like i did too much then she feels like i did too much because i would feel if i was her i would probably feel like i did too much but if she didn't but she, she's done weird stuff like that in the past i didn't just randomly like cut her off but i just felt like venting a little bit because yeah i was feeling really bad and she's really my bitch so we'll just see because i really like her so we'll see i'll let y'all know oh and to update y'all it's 5 23 it was like 4 58 last time like right before five so I've been thinking about it for about 20 minutes, a little over 20 minutes, so. I'm gonna just talk there. Like, oh, gee, I thought <laughs> Anyway, that's what I get for, um, put a negative energy into the universe, but yeah, I thought he was about to bring me my food. He's bringing out the, the food for the car in front of me. I've noticed that Whataburger is a little, the prices are different in different cities. Like in Houston, it's like 7 60 something. But yeah, um, in Houston, it's 7 60 something. Down here is 8 11 for number seven, which is a three, three piece chicken finger combo it's three chicken tenders basically with some fries and a drink but like it's crazy i mean whataburger's drinks are huge but yeah it's cheaper in houston i guess it's a franchise but that's why they just make up whatever price they want that's annoying it does not take that long to cook some food like it's crazy but i'm gonna be patient i'm so impatient it's crazy Interesting. So yeah, um, I'm just irritated because I just came from work and I came to meet a customer today and he didn't even spend money like he was supposed to be spending money. So I feel like I wasted my day because I really didn't feel like being at work today because I worked last night in Austin and I just got back today. But I sucked it up and woke up and came here. And today ended up being really bad. But I mean, I made something, so I'm not gonna complain, but like, <sighs> good vibes, good vibes, like, my good vibes. <sighs> Okay, I just finished rolling up, about to go home, but yeah, like, I really, I low-key thought it was going to be some drama today at work, because, um, last time I was here, it was, um, this girl, and she was talking about my, my homegirl, I don't know what she said, but when I like, walked into the locker room, I heard her saying her name. But I did. She was like, um, she had my homegirl name, and she was saying like some other stuff. Something a little, I heard a little bit. So I told my homegirl about that last time I was at work when I saw her. So it was the time before last time I was at work. The last time I was at work, I saw my homegirl and I told her about it. And um, she was telling me, she just called me up on all the drama that was going on telling me how the girl because i told her that the girl who was talking about her was talking to another girl who she had a problem with who she has a problem with she was like that's the only girl who because when i told her about it, i was like i couldn't think of her name but i was like she was talking to so-and-so which is the girl i do know the name of and the girl that like 
Um, I, I kind of know because we're kind of cool. But at first, I didn't say her name because she was like, I can't, I don't know who you're talking about. And I was like, I was, and I just let it go. She was like, the only girl I can think about that kind of matched the description is so and so, which is the girl I know who I'm kind of cool with. And I was like, well, she was talking to so and so. And so um, she was like, oh, so she was like, so and so got a problem with me. Like, of course, like, this is and that. And it was just being really petty. Like, it was just like, she was like, um, I'm not even gonna go into it, but. But yeah, I only know the girl because um, her pimp was trying to like spit game on me or whatever like that. And he was cute. So I was just asking about like what they had going on. I was asking their DJ about what they had going on. But um, yeah, he supposedly had cut her off last time I heard. But um, it was in a club last time together. So duh. He obviously did. But yeah, like. Um, Neither one of them, nobody was at work today. Nobody was at work today. Like, like obviously girls were here, but like nobody I talked to. Like one girl I kind of talked to, but she clicked up with this other girl who I don't talk to. So today was really dry and just not the best day. But um, um, that was a little, that was a little bit of of the work drama, and I know I probably um talk too much but um yeah like I feel like I should be able to um talk about the interesting things I find interesting at work like because I was like oh this goes on at night shift I don't even be standing there, like when I work night shift even though I should but um at this club at least but um I was like cool during the day like I don't even know like what y'all be having going on at night and she was like I was telling my homegirl she was like, um, I already know um, she was with so-and-so because she always with so-and-so. So she already knew what was going on. She was like, I don't got a problem with nobody. She really cool, but like, I met a new friend today. She was sweet. And um, they made me change my name today. Like that was so annoying. I guess the girl who um, had my dance name was got rehired and they made me change my dance name which is annoying i mean i did just get hired at this club but it's like if she didn't work in no more y'all should have made her pick a new name so i'm kind of off this club a little bit but i'm about to go home it is 11 01 we closed at two the lights <laughs> but yeah um we closed at two it's 11 01 i'm about to go home get some wind. But yeah, uh, I wanted to update y'all because I know I said I was going to apologize to my friend and I still might, but at this point I ran into her and her energy could be terrible. Not terrible, let me stop capping, but it's not welcoming and I'm already kind of over the friendship because I do feel like, I mean, I didn't do anything and I was seeing signs, followed my intuition, but I mean, if she want to be friends, we can still be friends, but I don't think I'm going to just try to make us friends and apologize but yeah like okay my hair is done it should be dry when i get home but yeah um i also wanted to like tune in because i was watching my video video i, was, I, be, I, was, I was putting it together basically and i was like i talk way too fast i'm doing it now i was like i need to work on that so i was like y'all probably didn't even understand me when i was telling my story about me and my friend. I think I did good with explaining what happened with my friend um, who came up to me. I mean, who um, saw my customer. The only thing, we used to do doubles and everything. But um, with, as in with the rumors and stuff, yeah. Um, as in like with the rumors and stuff, my friend, I'm gonna call her. Yeah. They just used to be friends. They fell out, nothing too major. But um, I know I need to be more like assertive when I talk, louder. I need to slow down so i wanted to just recap that because i know y'all probably didn't understand me and just check in but i'm about to go to work um it's already six o'clock but yeah like let me go ahead so i rolled my blunt and so 
yeah okay wait <laughs> my freaking i'll be trying not to use so many lights because it's really unnecessary oh there's a few things i forgot to do <laughs> so i'm gonna show y'all my bag from last night So yeah, that's that. I'm about to put it in the ATM. And that's gonna be, and that's gonna be that. This real nigga, I will go broke just to stack for you. Anything you go through, I'm here with you. I will go through hell and back for you.